Okay, one, two, check. All right, it's on this time. All right, anyways. Woo! Buccaneers! We get another W in Denver. And man, what an explosive time for offense to be in in the first half. Tom Brady having three touchdown passes to Mike Evans and Chris Godwin. Chris Godwin pulled in five receptions, 64 yards. Mike Evans a very lowly two for two, but those two TDs don't lie. Our defense, we have been constantly hitting Jeff Driscoll today. We got an interception from him, and we got an interception from his backup, Brett Ripien, who is probably <laughs> going to be starting on Thursday night against the New York Jets. And Brett, if you're watching this right now, good luck and welcome to the NFL because the Jets, oh man, they're not going to let you go down the field with your short passes like we did on your last possession. Running game. We have completely shut down Melvin Gordon. We have shut down Jeff Driscoll when he tried to run. KJ Hamler. One carry for negative two yards. Ronald Jones and Leonard Fournette, on the other hand, are combining for 68 yards on the ground. Sure, there were no touchdowns, but what they really need to be because we beat the Broncos 28-10. to We got a safety. We got a blocked punt at the start that we took advantage of with Chris Godwin. <sighs> Oh, man. When we look back at that block punt and we recovered it too, it just really set the tone for what the game was going to be like. Shaquille Barrett in his homecoming for the Denver Broncos. Two sacks and he managed to get a safety for us. My man, that's why we signed you. That's why we kept you to a franchise tag. Keep making plays like that, and you're going to be an honorary buck in no time. Mike Edwards for 30 yards on an interception late in the game. And Levante David with quarterback pressure from Jeff Driscoll getting hit. Ball was wobbling up in the air. Interception. Good on you, guys. Good on you. Vita Vey wants one sack. Man. And even with our offense sputtering out in the second half, our defense managed to play stout. They didn't allow any points in the second half. You hear this, Atlanta Chokins? You hear that, Atlanta? Coming off your loss to Chicago? That's why I'm calling you the Chokins, because you choked another game. Take notes on our game against Denver, because that's the way to not let a comeback happen with a backup quarterback that's the way to not let Nick Foles run down the field and score 20 on you in the fourth quarter Falcons you are up 16 points in your game against the Chicago Bears going into the fourth quarter you choked another one congratulations Chokins you're now 0-3 we're sitting up here at 2-1 first in the division pending the Saints Packers game and boy, when we go home next week and we play against the San Diego Chargers with Justin Herbert, we're guaranteed to go 3-1 and one with how stout our defense is doing. Todd Bowles, honorary props to you for your mix of blitzes, zones, and man throughout the game. Holding Denver to 10 points like that. Props to you, man. Props to you.